So you guys want to reload fast. Well, this is the video for you. Well, this is my Nerf Retaliator class I'm using. As the regular front barrel. It's customized by my friend. Doesn't have a YouTube channel. So I have the clip magazine, whatever it's called. I forgot what it's called. Yeah, it's called a magazine. Not a clip. This. The stock. Regular body. Also the regular barrel. She's got two kids in a broken down car. I mean, what's next? You want to have some popcorn to move in with us? Yeah, and I have no darts right now. I just have 12. See, so yeah, I'll show you how to reload faster. And I, I do not know if this should be dark. So, what you want to do is hold the trigger. You know what? This might not be a good idea. We've got rain, electricity. Oh, but I sure do appreciate it. I'm watching Gary's area like before the second one. Like, first. And then you, know, you want to so go back. This is how you know that it's you done right. Me. That looks like this. Right the oh, this. I like using this because it's pretty much kind of old. But now I will get a dark. <laughs> <laughs> so, I just got a dart. And if you haven't noticed, I like using the retaliator because it looks like a glow. There's under here, under here, if you haven't noticed. I want to do this. And right now, the only weapon I know that works for is this retaliator. I'm going to put it under. Okay. For people that don't know how to reload, how to do this fast, what I'm going to do is take out your club. Oh, that is so cool. That's a Satchel Page Bloodhead. That's what you played for the Monarchs. You want to do that? And this quickly moves from here, from here to here. So now, Let's see. No, it does not. It does not shoot the dart because I. Look, I'll even show you this. Yes. Excuse me? Oh, <laughs> I don't mind. You know, if you need a lift, I'll give you one. Okay. Don't just touch it. No shots. I prefer it by a minute. Yeah, you saw that blue thing? That was the dark. So yeah, note to self. If you do that, just put in the clip, but you just, it'll just do, just take out the clip, put it in, but still, it won't shoot a dart. So yeah. I guess no, this is why. This is why I tested it out. Now where the heck? Perfect! It went right on behind my bed. I still have the grip. Whenever I put it in, the grip. For me, it kind of looks like an M4A1 for Call of Duty 4. Like, really, it looks like that. I like getting. Like, I, Mom, like, I put some weight on this. So I put some weight on this. Like this, I kind of like because then you you remove the because it's not the front. It's a short barrel.
you get, but but it's more move more nozzle. But you get more mobi mobility. But don't do it too hard because, as you guys just saw, my my sight my my ACOG sight is what I call this because it looks like an ACOG. No damage. Because then you get to shoot. The more move, movable. And you don't get the best front for moving, but you get at least a good one. It's not, may not be that comfortable, but it's okay. Now, like this, this is a pistol. Manure style. All you gotta do is do this. I know even more mobile. Then you can shoot like this. Like you could do like you could do shoot like a gang stuff. Like this. So yeah. Pretty much good. You're more 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 like so much like this. I call this the shotgun class, like the heavy shotguns. Like some heavy shotguns, some shotguns don't even have a stock. No, yeah, like I get this because then you could use the sights. You're kind of more, more, more nimble. The more you're more, more, you kind of move more. The more movable with is out the front. Cause the front just puts more weight than holding the this one. And I'm all the way over here in this barrel. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm kind of shaking. So like, so yeah. If you're going um lightweight like an operator, no, I can't. I'll lose the whole front. I'll just stick with the stock because then you're because all you gotta do is do this. You may not have that much sight, but what you want, but your sight is this orange thing that holds it. Like there's something here, right here that makes sure. That um that that, that makes sure that it stays put. So yeah, you don't want to go like around like this too much, like that or that, or so you could break something. Look, I hit my line. Alright, we're gonna take your ears here, yeah, boy, because I'm gonna embarrass you. You can move more. You move more like this. It's fine if you have the full, but you know, a little bit more weight. So yeah, if you want to move more, just stick with this. I don't know why. Somebody has to lose. Did lose. Yeah. This will be able to give you more mobility and, a, and I think more accuracy. Because it's a short barrel nozzle. So like it kind of looks like an SN6 from Advanced Warfare. Or an MP5. Okay. It's not really oh, that. But this is my first ever clip. I feel all the steps. I have soft, soft socks. As this, the Maverick. It's the Rev 8. AKA Revolver. Because it looks like a revolver. I started doing that. I don't really 
looking like this gun. Yeah. But it kind of looks like a CSGO. Well, it kind of uh, looks like a, like some Nerf noobs hold pistols like this. Like thinking that's a primary. Like, like that, but no. You gotta hold it like this. Two hundred or one. I have so sick of this. Doesn't have battery. I hello? 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 Kelly's done that. It's the barricade. So like I don't have batteries. What is this? And I also don't I have batteries and also I don't have to think. But here's what I like. You could attach the stock from the retaliator and put it up here. And then it kind of looks like you have a grenade launcher. Short nozzle. And it does not have such a good sights. But it's pretty much semi auto. I don't finger bang because my thoughts are finger banging. The camera can't even catch up. So like, like, like. This pretty much gives you a lot of mobility, a lot more than the pistol version, because still, this does have some weight, and I'm holding it by stock. But I'm right here, I don't have that much weight. Then I have a crossbow, which I'll have to pause. A stood nerve zombie strike. Crossbow. I call it a crossbow because it is. But here's what I don't get. The new um fire thing that looks is exactly like this, but red and without this. How does nobody get that? Like I call it a crossbow because it is. Literally, it is. And then, what I like to put on this is an A cog because it looks better. Because crossbows always have bad, bad sights. These crossbows in there they have bad sights, but they're like bad iron sights, aka plastic sights because this is plastic. And this gives you much more accuracy, even if you don't have enough. You can still attach something on top of this reel. How? That doesn't even really make sense, but whatever. Like, as you can see, it's kind of old. So yeah, like, crossbow is okay. It's not that much weight. It's like, you could come running around like this and if I take this off boom that's how you know that is that new weapon nerf see it looks just like it and oh yeah I like this without it because it looks like a huge strong ass pistol pistol like it packs a lot of power and then you gotta do this and it's front reloading. And reload and boom! So yeah, those are all of my nerf guns. I had more, but nope, they're in trash. So yeah. See you guys in the next episode.